everyone and welcome to Number Club. Now, as you can see here, I've got some things next to me and you're probably familiar with these if you are teaching. And they're the part, part, whole model for finding the parts of a number. Now, you could use something like this, which is just printed from Twinkle, or I've got a frame here that I've made myself from an old picture frame. And um, I thought I would share with you a song that I use to teach the parts of numbers. And it goes down quite well with my children in class. So here it goes. Today we are going to be thinking about the number five. So I'm going to pop that up here because that is going to be a whole number. Now I love Numicon, so I'm going to use a mixture of Numicon and Multilink today. I want my Numicon piece to show that whole. Okay. So here's my whole number and I'm going to check with the children that I've got five cubes to go with my Numicon piece. So you ready? One, two, three, four, five. So I am ready. I can put my hole up there because I know that I've got a hole of five here. But I'm just going to put these along the bottom here just for now. Because then we are going to put them into our parts. Now, at first, I think I am going to put them all on one side. Because I want to show a systematic approach to finding the parts of a number. So I'm going to have them all here. Okay. And then I'm ready to sing my song. Five is a part and zero is a part. Put them all together and five is the whole. Then we change it. Four is a part, one is a part. Put them all together and five is the whole. Three is a part. Two is a part, put them all together and five is the whole. Two is a part, three is a part, put them all together and five is the whole. One is a part, four is a part, put them all together and five is the whole. Zero is the part, five is the part, put them all together and five is the whole. Now in my class I would have unifix cubes and each child would have five and be doing it with me. Okay, so we would start and we use our hands as our parts. Two parts and our whole is just here. That makes that, that same kind of visual. Okay, so then I'll do five is the part, zero is the part, is the part, put them all together and five is the whole, because we'd remember the five, okay? And then we change it. Four is the part, one is the part, put them all together and five is the whole, and we'd bring them together, okay? So then we'd split them off. Three is the part, two is the part, Put them all together and five is the whole. And you carry on. It's a nice, simple, catchy song. It really does get stuck in the children's heads. And I find them singing it and playing it in the maths area on their own. Now, if you wanted to take this song a little further, carry on watching and I will show you. Because then I would introduce how the number sentence would be written. I hope this is helpful for you. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it doesn't get stuck in your head too much. I'll see you soon. Bye.